Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to be going through important vocabulary when it comes to parts of a multiplication problem. And specifically, we're going to take a look at factors, partial products, and product. And we'll go through two example problems here, point out what these words mean in order to get this down. So let's jump right into number one here where we have 15 times four equals 60. So the two numbers that we multiplied together, the 15 and the four, these are factors. So the numbers you multiply together in order to get an answer are the factors. Now the 60 or any answer to a, to a multiplication problem, this is our product. So the 60 there is our product. And for number two, we have 37 times 14. And I solve the problem there. So again, the two numbers that we multiply together, this 37 and the 14, these are factors. Now, when we have a two by two problem, which when I say two by two, that means we have a two digit number times a two digit number. As we go through the process, we get to two numbers that we add together to get our answer. These are called partial products. And it makes sense, they're part of our final answer or product. So these are our partial products. And then lastly, our answer, an answer to a multiplication problem is called the product. So there you have it. There are some important parts of a multiplication problem, factors, partial products, and product. If you're looking for a little more help when it comes to the process of multiplication, I dropped links to those videos down in the description. This video was more so about the vocabulary. I hope this helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.